Hey guys, I'm Oak Dream and I like warriors. And today we're going to talk about congenital sensory neural deafness in cats. Let's start from the beginning. So we all know that the poor snow kit, a handsome kit with a white coat and blue eyes, was carried off by a hawk in the Prophecies Begin arc, aka a dangerous path. Snow kit was also deaf, making it impossible for him to hear the hawk, limiting his speech and response time as well. After this happened, a quote from Dappletail, an elder, said, Kits with a white coat are often deaf. But what does this mean? Why is it more common in these kind of cats? Well, let's find out. Again, it's called congenital sensory neural deafness. I hope I said that right. It can happen in cats with yellow, green, or brown eyes and a white coat, but it's most likely going to happen in cats with a white coat and blue eyes. For example, in cats with heterochromia, see my other video to find out what that's about, deafness will most likely occur in the ear on the other side of the blue eye. Like the side of the head where the blue eye is. That ear. The reason why it's so common with blue-eyed white pelted cats is that the white pelt is a dominant masking gene. This means that when, if they have the gene, the white masking covers all of the other colors they may have and prevents melanin from developing. This masking may happen to their eyes as well, making the iris blue, and of course it can happen to their ears. It's m important to note that cats like this are not albino. I'm making a video on that later. The organ of the ear, receptor organ for hearing, sometimes degenerates within the first few weeks because of this, making the cat deaf. That's all for now. Bye!